Hello students, it's Dual Algebra, exercise 14c, questions 7 and 8. This is found on page number 156. We are continuing with multiplication, question 7. Here we are multiplying two binomials. The first one is a binomial and second is also a binomial. Binomial and the second expression is also a binomial. So we can arrange them one below the other in columns okay so x plus 2 into x plus 10 right so now we start with x here we will multiply this with x plus 2 so first we multiply x into x so x into x will be x to the power of 1 plus 1 which is x square or x to the power of 2 so here we have x square now we are going to multiply x with 2 so that will be x into 2 which is 2x so let's write plus 2x so we finish multiplying with x here now we're going to multiply with 10 so let's multiply 10 and x so that becomes 10 into x which is 10x. So let me write it in the x column. So that is plus 10x. So now we finish multiplying 10 into x. So let's multiply 10 into 2. So 10 twos we know is 20. 10 twos are 20. So we'll just write 20 here by the side. Now let's work this out. So in the x square, x square column we have only x square. Now in the next column we have plus 2x plus 10x. So signs are the same, put the same sign and add 10 plus 2 is 12 and then we write x and then here we have 20. So what's the final answer? x square plus 12x plus 20. Question 2. Again we have two binomials so let's write them down one below the other. We have x plus 5 into x minus 3. So let's start by multiplying this x and this x. So x into x will be x to the power of 1 plus 1, which is x to the power of 2 or x squared. Let's write it down here. So we finish multiplying x with this x. Now we are going to multiply x with 5. So x and 5 we will multiply. x into 5 is 5x. So let's write that down here, plus 5x. So we finished multiplying with x. Now we're going to multiply with 3. So we'll do 3 into x. 3 into x will be 3x. So we'll put it in this column. Now here we need to be very careful. Here we have a minus sign. So minus 3 into x will be minus 3x. So we have to put the minus sign there and put it in the x column minus 3x. Now we finish multiplying with x. Let's multiply minus 3 into 5. So minus 3 into plus 5. So minus into plus is minus. 3 fives are 15. So here we get minus 15. So let's work out from the x uh, square column. So here we have x square. Now, moving on to the x column, signs are different. Put the sign of the bigger number and subtract. 5 minus 3 is 2, 2x, and this is minus 15. So, what's our final answer? x squared plus 2x minus 15. Question 3. x minus 5 and x plus 3. So, let's multiply x minus 5 into x plus 3. So first we start with x into x. So this x into this x. So that will be x into x. That is x to the power of 1 plus 1, which is x to the power of 2. So we are writing x squared here. And now we're going to multiply x with minus 5. So x into minus 5. So this is plus. So plus into minus is minus 5x. So the answer is minus 5x. So we'll write it down here, minus 5x. And then we're going to multiply. Now we finished with x. Now we're going to multiply with 3. So we'll do 
3 and x. So 3 into x is 3x. So we can write that here under the x column. So that will be plus 3x. Now let's multiply 3 into minus 5. So 3 into minus 5. This is plus. So plus into minus is minus 3 fives are 15. So our answer here is minus 15, which we will write separately. Now let's work out x square. And here, signs are different. Let's put the signs of bigger number and subtract. 5 minus 3 is 2x minus 15. Let's take 4x minus 5 and x minus 3. So first, let's take x into x. So that will be x into x, which is x to the power of 1 plus 1, which is x square. So let's write that down. So this is x square. Now, Let's take x into minus 5. So x into minus 5 will be minus 5x. Okay, so that is minus 5x. Now let's take minus 3 into x. So that is minus 3 into x will be minus 3x. We have written it down here. Now let's take minus 3 into minus 5. So minus 3 into minus 5. Minus into minus is plus. 3 fives are 15. So we've got plus 15, which we are going to write it here by the side. So now let's start with x square. x square. Then going on to x, the signs are the same. Put the same sign and add. 5 plus 3 is 8. So that's 8x plus 15. So that's our answer. x square minus 8x plus 15 x plus y, 2x plus y into x plus 3y. So first we're going to do with x and 2x. So let's multiply x into 2x. So this is 1. So the numbers will become 1 into 2 and x into x. 1, 2 is 2 into x to the power of 1 plus 1 which is 2x to the power of 2. So let's write that down. We have 2x square. So now we finished with x into 2x. We'll do x into y. So x into y is simply xy. So let's write that down. Plus xy. So now we're going to multiply 3y into 2x. So 3y into 2x. So that will be 3 into 2 into x into y. There's only 1x and 1y. 3 twos are 6xy. So let's put it in the xy column. So here it is. So let's write it below it. 6xy. Now let's multiply 3y into y. So 3y into y will be 3 into y into y, which is 3 into y to the power of 1 plus 1, which is 3y square. So that's a separate column. So let's write plus 3y square separately. Now let's work out the x square. We have 2x square. Now let's go on to the xy column. So this is 1xy. Signs are the same. Put the same sign. And 6 plus 1 is 7xy plus 3y squared. So we have 2x squared plus 7xy plus 3y squared. Question 6. 3x minus 5y. 3x minus 5y into x plus 6y. So let's multiply x into 3x. So x into 3x. So this is 1. So the numbers are 1 into 3 and x into x, which is 3 into x to the power of 1 plus 1, which is 3x squared. So we'll write it down here, 3x squared. Now we are going to multiply x into minus 5y. So x into minus 5y. So let's write 1 here. So the numbers are 1 into, this will be plus 1, minus 5 into 
we have 1x and 1y. So let's multiply the numbers. Plus into minus is minus. 1 fives are 5 x y. So that is minus 5 x y. Minus 5 x y. Now let's multiply 6 y into 3 x. So 6 y into 3 x. So that will be 6 into 3 into y into x. So 6 3s are 18. Then we'll put x, we we'll put y in order. So now we have 18 x y. Let's put it in the x y column that is plus. So 18 x y. Now let's multiply 6 y into minus 5 y. So we have plus 6 y into minus 5 y. So let's take the numbers plus 6 into minus 5. Now y into y. So here we have inside here plus into minus is minus 6 5 is a 30 into y to the power of 1 plus 1 which is minus 30 y square. So that's a separate column minus 30 y square. Now let's do the x square column. So we have 3x square. We'll move to xy. Here we have minus 5 and plus 18. Signs are different. Put the sign of a bigger number and subtract. 18 minus 5 is 13. 13 xy. And here we have minus 30 y square. So here let's multiply x plus 9y into x minus 5 y. So first let's take x into x. So x into x will be x to the power of 1 plus 1 which is x squared. So let's write x square here. Now we finish multiplying with x. Let's multiply x into 9y. So let's do that. x into 9y will be 9xy. So let's write that down. Plus 9 x y. So we finish multiplying with x and 9 y. Now let's multiply minus 5 y and x. So that's minus 5 y into x. That is minus 5 into 1. This is 1 here and this is y into x. So minus into plus is minus 5 ones are 5 x y. So minus 5 x y minus 5 x y. Now let's go on to minus 5y into plus 9y. So let's write that down. Minus 5y into plus 9y. So we'll take the numbers minus 5 into plus 9 and then we take y into y. So that becomes minus into plus is minus 5 nines are 45. y to the power of 1 plus 1 which is minus 45 y to the power of 2. So this is minus 45 y square. So x square and here signs are different. Let's put the sign the bigger number and subtract. 9 minus 5 is 4. 4 x y minus 45 y square. Question 8. 2 x plus 5 y into 2x again plus 5y. So first we multiply 2x into 2x. 2x into 2x. Take the numbers 2 into 2. Take only the x. x into x. So that becomes 2 twos are 4 into x to the power of 1 plus 1 which is 4x to the power of 2. So let's write 4x squared. Now 2x into plus 5y. So 2x into 5y. Let's take the numbers. 2 into 5 into x into y. 2 5s are 10 xy. So we have plus 10 xy. So let's write that down. Plus 10 xy. Now let's multiply plus y into 2x. So let's do that. 5y into 2x. So that becomes the numbers 5 2s and then here we write into y into x. Now 5 2s are 10 
and then here we have we'll put it in order x y so 10 x y let's put it under the x y column so that is 10 x y now we multiply 5 y into 5 y so 5 y into 5 y numbers will be 5 into 5 and y into y 5 fives are 25 into y to the power of 1 plus 1 which is 25 y to the power of 2 which we'll write separately here so that is plus 25 y squared so here we have 4x square and in the xy column signs are the same so let's put the same sign and add 10 plus 10 is 20 xy and here we'll write 25 y squared question 8 multiply 3 a b c and minus 5 a square b square c so let's do that 3 a b c into minus 5 a square b square c so we can work this out here itself so let's take the numbers first so we have plus 3 into minus 5 into let's take the a's so here i have 1a and here i have a square so that will be a into a square now let's go to b so i have 1b here and a b square there so let's write that down into b into b square now let's take the c c and c so there's one of each so that is c into c okay now here when signs are different here in multiplication plus into minus is minus three fives are 15 into a to the power of one plus two into b to the power of one plus two into c to the power of one plus one so i have one here and one here now this becomes minus 15 into a to the power of 3 into b to the power of 3 into c to the power of 2 so finally minus 15 a cubed b cubed c square question 2 x minus y plus z into minus 2x so now let's multiply minus 2x into x so minus 2x into x so let's take the numbers it's minus 2 into 1 and x into x so that will be minus 2 into x to the power of 1 plus 1 minus 2x square so this is minus 2x square so now we finish multiplying with x now let's multiply with minus y so minus 2x into minus y so again that's 1y so the numbers will be minus 2 into minus 1 into x into y so minus into minus is plus 2 ones are 2 x y so here we have plus 2 x y now let's my, uh, multiply minus 2x and z so minus 2x into 1z so let's put the numbers minus 2 into plus 1 into x into z so minus into plus is minus 2 ones are 2 x z so here we have minus 2 x z question 3 2x minus 3y minus 5z let's write it down 2x minus 3y minus 5z into minus 2y so first we multiply minus 2y into 2x minus 2y into 2x let's take the numbers minus 2 into 2 into x into y minus into plus is minus two twos are four x y so here it is minus four x y now we multiply minus two y into minus three y so 
So minus 2y into minus 3y. First the numbers minus 2 into minus 3 into y into y. So that becomes minus into minus is plus 2 3s are 6 into y to the power of 1 plus 1 which is plus 6y squared. So here we write plus 6y squared. So now we finish multiplying with 3y. Let's multiply with minus 5z. So minus 2y into minus 5z. So minus 2 into minus 5 into y into z. Minus into minus is plus 2 5s are 10 y z. So here we get plus 10 y z. Question 4. So here we have minus 8 x y z plus 10 x square y z cube into x y z. So first let's multiply x y z into this. So let's do that x y z into minus 8 x y z. Okay, so this is 1. So the numbers are 1 into 8, 1 into minus 8 into, let's take the x, there's 1 here and 1 there. So that is x into x into, let's take the y, 1 here and 1 there. So that is y into y. Then the z, we have 1 here and 1 there. So z into z. So this becomes minus into plus is minus 1 8 is 8 into x to the power of 1 plus 1 into y to the power of 1 plus 1 into z to the power of 1 plus 1. So this is minus 8 x square y square z square. So let's write that down here. Minus 8 x square y square z square plus now we're going to multiply x, y, z into this term. So let's start that now. x, y, z into 10 x square y, z cube. So this is 1. So the numbers are 1 into 10 into, let's take the x. 1x here and x square the x into x square. Now let's take the y's. We have y and y here. So that will be y into y. Now let's take the z. We have one z here and x cube here. So z into z cube. Now let's work it out. 1 tens are 10 into x to the power of 1 plus 2 into y to the power of 1 plus 1 into z to the power of 1 plus 3. So that becomes 10 x to the power of 3, y to the power of 2, and z to the power of 4. So what do we have here? 10 x cube, y square, and z to the power of 4. Question 5. So we have this polynomial multiplied by x, y, z. So we'll write that polynomial first. Minus 13 x, y, square, z plus 15 x, square, y, z minus 6 x, y, z square. The whole thing multiplied by x, y, z. So we'll multiply this term into this term. So I've written it there. We'll take the numbers 1 into minus 13. Now let's take the x here. We have 1x and 1x. So that will be x into x into. Let's take the y's. I have y into y square. And let's take the z. It's z into z. Okay, so that becomes. 1 into 13 is 13 and we have minus 13 into x to the power of 1 plus 1 into y to the power of 1 plus 2 into z to the power of 1 plus 1. So that becomes minus 13x square 
y to the power of 3 and z to the power of 2. So let's write it down. Minus 13x square y cube z square. Now we are going to multiply x, y, z into the next term. So let's multiply. So I'll take the numbers 1 into 15 and then I'll take the x which is x into x square. Then let's take the y which is y into y and then the z which is z into z. Okay. Now 1 into 15 is 15. Then we have x to the power of 1 plus 2 into y to the power of 1 plus 1 into z to the power of 1 plus 1. So what do we have here? 15, x to the power of 3, y to the power of 2 and z to the power of 2. So let's write that down. Plus 15, x cube, y square, z square. Now let's take x, y, z into minus 6 x, y, z square. So x, y, z into minus 6 x, y, z square. So this is 1. So the numbers will be 1 into minus 6 into x into x into y into y into z into z square. So that will be minus into plus will be minus 1 6 is a 6 into x to the power of 1 plus 1 into y to the power of 1 plus 1 into z to the power of 1 plus 2. So minus 6 x to the power of 2 y to the power of 2 and z to the power of 3. So the final answer here is minus 6 x square y square and z Cube. Next question, we have 4abc, this whole polynomial multiplied by minus 2abc squared. So let's start. We'll multiply this term with this term. So that is minus 2abc squared into 4abc. The numbers are minus 2 into 4. The letters are a into a into b into b into c square into c. So minus into plus is minus 2 fours are 8 into a to the power of 1 plus 1 into b to the power of 1 plus 1 into c to the power of 2 plus 1. So this becomes minus 8 into a to the power of 2 into b to the power of 2 into c to the power of 3. So, minus 8a square b square c cube. So, let's write that down. Minus 8a square b square c cube. So, now let's multiply these two terms. So, I've written it there. Let's take the numbers. Minus 2 into minus 5 into a into a square into b into b into c square into c. So what do we get? Minus into minus is plus. 2 fives are 10 into a to the power of 1 plus 2 into b to the power of 1 plus 1 into c to the power of 2 plus 1. So what do we get? 10 a to the power of 3 b to the power of 2 and c to the power of 3. So let's write that down. So that is plus plus 10 a cubed b square c cubed. Now let's multiply these two terms. So the numbers are minus 2 into minus 6 into a into a into b into b square into c square into c. Let's multiply. Minus into minus is plus. 2 6 are 12 into a to the power of 1 plus 1 into b to the power of 1 plus 2 into c to the power of 2 plus 1. So that is 12 a square b to the power of 3 and c to the power of 3. So plus 
12 a square b cubed c cubed so we'll stop with that for now children in our next video we will do algebra exercise 14c question 9 thank you children